Hey guys, welcome to SS Unitech Susil this side and this is continuation of Power BI tutorial. So today we are going to discuss about the types of filters in Power BI desktop. So this is very important while we are going to apply the filters on the dashboards. So here we'll see how many types of filters are available so that we can apply in our dashboards to make our dashboard more interactive. So here basically we have three types of filters. First, we can apply the filters at the page level. Second, we can apply the filter for all pages. And last one, we can apply the filter for any particular visuals. So here we have three types of filters. So let's see in the practical one by one. So go to on the Power BI desktop. So this is our project by which we have currently working on. So basically here, let me add a column chart so we can use this and let me try to make it a little bit bigger and try to use a line chart and this is the line chart in the column chart go to our table and here let me try to use the country name in the axis so this is the country name so we can drag and drop in the axis and in the value order quantity do the same for the line chart here in the axis let me drag and drop the country and here order quantity that should go in the value so here you can see this is our column chart and this is our line chart so what we want we want to apply the filter for this where we want to see only united states nothing else so how we can do that here you can see you are having this option that is filters so let me expand this and here you can see the filter on this page and second one filter on all pages for example here you can see we are having few pages so if we'll apply any filter on the filters on all pages so that filter will be applied for all page so let's try let me drag and drop the country name in the filters on all pages and here let me select for Australia only so here you can see it is filtered and you will see only one column that is Australia and here you can see a point that is Australia so as we have applied this filter for all pages so go to all the other pages and let's see so go to on the hierarchy and drill downs so here you can see only one and it is Australia so this is that we have in filters on all pages let me remove that so here you can see let me go to on the hierarchy and drill downs so here you can see all the values so this is our first type go to on the second type apply the filter only for this page let me try to drag and drop the country name in the filter on this page and here let me select australia so here you can see it is filtered like these two visuals has been filtered for the australia only if we will see in other pages like in hierarchy and drill downs then we are not going to filter the data so this is for we are filtering on that particular page now let me remove that as well and here let me select any visual as here we have two visuals so i am going to select the column chart and here you can see one more option that will have these filters like filter on this visual first as we have used country name and order quantity columns so by default it should be present over here and if you want to apply the filter on that so you can do that if you want to use any another field then you can drag and drop like you can see the city let me try to drag the city and drop in this so here you can see all these cities so first I want to apply the filter only for Australia so go to on the country name and here let me filter for Australia so here you can see the order quantity that is 18,288 now go to on the city and let me filter for city so here let me select few cities like I have selected these four now you can see the value so it is only 1490 so like it is filtering only for this column chart 
if you will see in the line chart then it is having the data for all the countries which is available in our data set so this is for the filter types in power bay desktop so thank you so much guys for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe our channel to get many more videos don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our newly uploaded videos thank you so much guys